You just run them out their way so it takes a good horse and some horsemanship, a really good hazer. I was lucky to have Olin Hannum, a good buddy of mine from Utah Hayes. And, uh, hopefully a good steer. There's a lot of them that are hard to place on, so I was fortunate. It was pretty good, but there's a lot of good guy, a lot of good guys to go. So if we could just come back to the shore, that'd be awesome. The second day, they always run harder after being chased the first time, so uh, it's a little more challenging, but it's a lot of fun. You, uh, as the coach, what does this mean? How does this help you when you're out there competing in the heat of it at one of the biggest rodeos there is? In terms of translating that to your to your kids? Yeah, it keeps it fresh in my mind because we talk about them and how they compete and uh, all the time. So then when I'm doing it, if it makes it easy to relate to them and be understanding, compassionate for what they're going through. This uh, gray horse we got from Riley Pruitt this winter, and he's green, been taking him this summer, just kind of made a commitment to ride him all year, and he did great here, so we're tickled.